This is the Gravis Ultrasound Max I've had for many years. I used it in my 100MHz IBM Aptiva. I always thought it was so cool not to select the Sound Blaster, but the Gravis Ultrasound Max in the audio settings. And this is what Doom will sound like. It sounds great, but can it be improved? This came with 512 kilobytes of RAM, but with the option to install an additional 512 kilobytes. So I have installed 256 kilobytes of 16-bit RAM. Gravis is using 8-bit, so it becomes 512 kilobytes. When installing this RAM, make sure the extra mark on the RAM lines up with pin 1. In the video description, there are links to more information on the RAM you should buy for your sound card. Let's boot up the 486 and listen to the difference. It sounds even better and you can hear more instruments, but we can improve the sound even further by installing new sets of patches. In the video description there are links to the patches. I am assuming you know the most common DOS commands, so I am not going to show you every single step. We are going to install Pro Patches Lite 161, so have the 160 and the 161 upgrade. Copy 1.60 over to your hard drive and make sure to remove the read-only attributes by going into the directory of your files and type in attrib-r to remove the read-only attribute and forward slash s to include any subfolders. Now copy over the 1.61 upgrade files in the same directory and again remove the read-only attributes. Now we can install the new patches and install it in your existing ultrasound folder. Let's hear the difference. That was quite a difference. Especially Duke Nukem 3D sounds much better with the new patches. Just listen. However, the scent won't sound right and Wacky Wheels doesn't work at all. So we need to be able to switch between the new and the original patches. We have to reinstall ultrasound drivers and select a different folder. Make sure you go through the whole installation process and reboot. Once the installation is complete, type in set ultra dir equals the path to your new or the old ultrasound folder to switch between them. To make it easier, you can make a couple of batch files in your game directory with these commands. Type in edit, type in your command and save it as a batch file.
Now you can easily enjoy all the games using the new and original patches. I hope you found this useful, thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time.